This morning, our Rebound KC series focuses on an effort to get more people working in skilled trades. We're talking about jobs like plumbing, welding, manufacturing. And 41 Action News reporter Charlie Keegan live for us this morning to explain why experts are focusing on this kind of work in particular. Charlie, good morning. Good morning, Taylor and Lindsay. We're looking at the numbers this morning. It all boils down to what predictions are coming in. By the year 2028, some people say there'll be more than 2 million job openings for welders and electricians, and there won't be people to pick up the welding supplies and do those jobs, fill those jobs. Now, part of the issue here is basically marketing. A lot of people think there aren't just, there just isn't enough of a spotlight on what kind of opportunity a skilled trade can provide. So KC-based group Project MFG is changing that. It's part of a group that is filming a competition style TV show, which you're looking at kind of behind the scenes there on your screen right now of this show that really highlights the trades. I had a chance to speak with the host of the show, country music singer Stephanie Quayle, who said raising awareness is step one toward filling that skills gap. It's an opportunity, it's a possibility. And I think when they see that it is, you know, there's so much unbridled talent, like it's a pathway. And it's, I mean, welding from jewelry to pipelines. I mean, that's pretty incredible. It is pretty incredible. And here's our rebound rundown to help you get into the skilled trade if that's something that you're interested in. Of course, there is job security because there's such high demand for these skilled workers. And experts say that these uh, skilled jobs are becoming more and more high tech, incorporating computers and softwares and whatnot. So experts say you can be open minded when choosing a skill to get involved with because there is something for everyone. And you should consider both community colleges and uh, apprenticeships to learn your trade. A lot of unions and companies will actually offer earn as you learn apprenticeships so you can learn while you, you know, work uh, on the job. All right, so that program, though, that they're filming here is called Clash of Trades, that competition-style TV show, Lindsay and Taylor. It'll debut on YouTube on April 20th, so mark your calendars to see that first episode. Charlie, tell us more about this show. Yeah. How does the show work? Okay, yeah, so it's a kind of a reality show, competition show, where there's four teams from four different colleges around the United States that are all building one thing using their skills that they've learned here at their colleges. But then, almost like in a chopped cooking show uh, twist, they all get one surprise that they have to incorporate into their project, make things interesting. A panel of judges here in Kansas City <laughs> decides the winner. That's cool. I like that a lot. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Good luck to all those contestants, Charlie. Thank you very much. Yeah.